Hello children, this is Grandma Carla with the last chapter of Skylark by Patricia McLaughlin. Chapter 15 I see the house, cried Caleb, standing up in the wagon, and the new barn. The wagon passed the cornfield, still dry, but we could see some green in the meadow. We turned into our yard, and Nick and Lottie ran and jumped up into the wagon before it stopped. Nick, Lottie! I laughed as they jumped on us, licking our faces. There's some water in the pond, said Papa. He looked at Caleb and me, and there are kittens waiting for you on the porch. Caleb and I ran to the porch where Seal washed her four kittens, three gray and one orange like Maggie's cat, Sam. Someone had left a bowl of water nearby. Look, Sarah. Caleb held the orange cat for Sarah to see. She smiled at us. And then she and Papa began to walk out to the fields to see the green. I watched them, Papa dressed in his wedding suit and Sarah in her yellow bonnet. And then Sarah bent down suddenly. Her traveling coat spread out behind her. She picked up a stick and she began to write in the dry earth. What is she doing? asked Caleb. I knew, but I didn't say anything. Papa turned and walked back to her, looking down at what she had written. She smiled up at him, and the two of them walked out into the fields in the late pale light of afternoon. Papa reached out and took Sarah's hand. Caleb and I walked down the steps. Under the post, where Caleb's glass still stood, Sarah had written one word in the prairie dirt. Sarah. Home. It has rained twice. But there is still dust. The corn still rattles in the wind. The green of Maine seems to be only a dream. When we came home by train, we passed trees and hills and lakes filled with water. They are beautiful, the trees and the hills and the lakes filled with water. But the prairie is home. The sky so big, it takes your breath away. The land like a giant quilt tossed out. It will rain again. There is some water in the pond, not enough for swimming, but there will be. There will be flowers in the spring, and the river will run again. And in the spring, there will be the new baby, Papa and Sarah's baby. Caleb, like Papa, is not always good with words, but I think Caleb says it best. Our baby. That is the end of Skylark. And although the book makes me cry, I really, really enjoy it. I hope you've enjoyed it too. And we'll pick up a new one. I found that there's other books to this series. And so I will be bringing them home and reading them as well. This is Grandma Carla, and I love you.